Do you have any king size candy bars? What? You don't? What? Do you now, bitch? This shit is not a game! Oh, oh, I'm too old to be trick or treating. My bad! Ah! <laughs> What is up, everybody? My name is Dom, and this is Ding Dong Dead, a horror game about, I think we're playing as a babysitter, and some ding dong ditching little bitch pulls up my shit, and then I blast their ass. Oh, wait. No, I think they've killed me. Okay, I'm pretty sure I get ding dong ditched. But I must not respond appropriately until they kill my ass. Y'all know I don't actually know how the gameplay goes! So let's just run this shit and we'll find out. I hope y'all enjoyed the little flashback to me when I was trick-or-treating back in my prime. Okay, this shit is not a game, but if you don't have king-size candy bars, fuck yourself! Dom, run this shit. Yes! Motherfucker! Yeah! Woo! Okay, y'all. Here we go! Here we go. So... What is this shit, bro? Oh my god. Okay, sorry, I was gonna say there is no menu screen on this game. You just spawn right into this shit. Um, wait, let me let me let me look at this real quick. Right! Okay, okay, okay. So I just read through that entire booklet of bullshit and basically got the main gist of the game. Um, and yeah, basically it just says we are a babysitter. Uh a letter from my parents congratulating me on getting my own apartment. Right, okay, and, um, oh, here it is, bitch. Here's the ad that we must have responded to. An ad I saw looking for babysitters. It's weird that I answered it. Uh, I've never babysat before. I can't explain it, but walking by it on the street, I was just drawn to pick it up. Weird! Okay, right, so I'm not already at my babysitting job. I need to go do that, and I don't think there's anything else to do in this apartment aside from that. So let's go ahead, we'll peel out, we'll go to my job, we'll go see who we're babysitting. I know it's a little fucking brat! Okay, I guarantee it is, bro. Oh, wow, and this house looks demented too. Ain't that insane? Now, look at the bottom- OH GOD! Ah, welcome. Thank you for watching our sweet angel on short notice. Yes, I have a very important ceremony to attend tonight that we simply could not miss. Not lest I am overlooked for a future promotion. Yes, we simply could not have that. Money is on the counter. Please order some pizza for Rex and yourself. Rex can stay up as late as he wants. We're using reverse psychology to make him want rules by not giving him any. Plus, we're tired of being parents. Remember to lock the door behind us. You can never be too careful these days. Yes, that's very true, dear. Oh, also, try not to have too many lights on at the same time. Uh, something's been going on with the fuse box. Bo, that's so fucking headass. If you forget on the power trips, just reset the fuse box and you'll be fine. You did remember to lock all the windows, dear. Uh, yeah. Probably. I'm sure you'll be fine. If it's okay. your first time babysitting, we left a note of instructions on the counter. Now come on, sweet cheeks, we mustn't be late! I would say call us if you have any trouble, but I know Rex will be an angel. Ta! -da! <laughs> okay, yeah, I'll fucking body, bitch. Okay, so I can give my friends a call too since the parents obviously don't care. Right, so I'm gonna, first of all, be locking the door, bitch. Okay, this shit is not a game to me. I, I read in the instructions that this is what you use to save the game. So let me go ahead and take that. I got a candy bowl. I don't know. Am I trick-or-treating on Halloween? I'm sure I don't know. This is fucking insane that the first thing they said when they when I walked in the front door was make sure you don't turn on too many lights. The fuse box is crusty, dusty, and musty. These windows are not locked, bro. These windows are not fucking locked. Okay, so I gotta go around this entire house and make sure that this bitch is secure. Y'all know for certain I'm not trying to get body tossed and bamboozled immediately on my first day in this joint. Good God almighty, it's dark in this motherfucker. Oh, this, oh, this shit is not a game. <laughs> oh my god, that bitch shook like a goddamn dildo, motherfucker. Okay, so little ghost bitch McGee, he over here laughing at me. There's a phone book. Let's see here. Maybe the brat would be easier to watch if I ordered some pizza. Ah, Papa Joel's. Let's order some of the best pizza in town. All right, I got the number now. I got some moxie points. Okay, I'm not really certain what half of those shits are down to the bottom. Um, wait a second. Oh, I blew the fucking fuse, bitch. Where did he say the power box was at? I literally can't see anything. This this game is fucking insane. Wait, I really should have found... I literally, I literally can't see anything, gang. Do you understand that? I can't see anything! Wait, Bo. 
Wait, Bo, dead ass. Am I, I think I'm walking into a corner. Can y'all see anything, bro? Oh, I've made a mistake. I've made a big fucking mistake. Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. This, 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 this shit's great. This shit's great. Wait a sec. Okay. So yeah, before you ask, I did completely restart the gameplay because there's no fucking shot. I'm walking around this bitch in the pitch black. Y'all got me fucked up, bitch. I ain't doing it. I ain't doing it. That shit's not for me. Okay. Let me, oh my God, bitch. I need to lock this shit. Wait. Bazinga. Okay, and I got some brain points. So clearly in this game, you cannot be leaving on lights for any extended period of time if you're not in the room, okay? In and out, baby, in and out. So turn it on, turn it off, turn it on, turn it off. Got it. Okay, so I can at least get two. Is this the fuse box? That's actually mad embarrassing, bitch. I was in the room where I fixed the lights at and I was bamboozled by that. That's fucking insane. Okay, lights off, keep it moving. I'm, I'm, I'm not doing any of this shit right now. Actually, let me get some brain points real quick. Or some moxie points. I don't know what the hell a moxie point is, bitch. I don't even know what that means. And why there's a sexiness counter down there and I'm a child? I'm sure I don't know. But all the same, let's keep it moving. Let me grab the floppy disk. Let me do this. And Oh, well, I, I'm not a child, am I? No, just kidding. I made that up. I'm a fucking... Uh, I got my own apartment. So just kidding. I made that up. All right, all right, all right. Okay. Oh. This little dildo bitch need to get the fuck on and stop laughing around me. Home, that's weird. It's stuck. It looks like there's something stuck in the keyhole. Of course there is, bitch. Now watch out, because I think, I think I'm about to go over my, uh, my light code here. Let me cut that off. Cut this on. And just keep getting a lay of the land, bitch. I'm just trying to get a lay of the land. Needs to be lit. Some useless knickknacks. Okay, got it, got it, got it. Fish tank, cool. I love fish. Right, okay, so the house is a pretty basic layout. I'm not really certain what that back room is or why it's there. Um, it seems to just be a, like, a random little hallway. Uh, let's see. Looking around, creepy-ass picture of the old man. I thought I was gonna get jump-scared there, I'm not gonna lie. Let me take that floppy disk, y'all know this shit is not a game to me. I got a mean save all the time game. I got some bleach, not really certain what I'm gonna be doing with that. Looks like a small door that is hidden behind these boxes. Move the box, what the hell is that? Wait a minute, what is this? It's locked. Looks like a crawl space. Right! Okay, so that's gonna be good to know. If we about to get jumped by a big-ass ghoul, we can use that to hide from his ass, which is good. I'm getting jump scared. Okay, fucking do it. Okay, let's not even act like I didn't see that shit coming. Okay, you talking to a high IQ gamer. Why this kid wearing that mask inside? <laughs> I got you good. You screamed like a girl, you bitch. That's insane. <laughs> I take it you're Rex. I'm, I'm your babysitter. Baby. Right. Do you want any pizza, you little shit? No. I bet you'll get your bitch germs on it. Okay, this kid getting stomped out. Boy, he about to, his face about to be looking like that. All right. If you're going to act like that, then just stay oh, in yeah? your room. And what if I don't? Then I'll choke slam your ass. Threaten physically. I'd probably backhand the shit I out of you. that. You're pretty cool. <laughs> Rex's respect increased. You goddamn right. Okay, this shit is not a game, but this shit is not a game. Go hide, moxie check. Hobbies, see ya. Uh, go hide, something's wrong. Moxie check failed. Yeah, right. You, I won't let you trick me. Wait, 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 what the fuck? Wait a minute. Oh, I, I can tell him. Be a... oh, 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 so if something goes sideways, I can tell him to go hide so that we don't get killed nasty. Uh, but I failed the moxie check because I had him go hide for no reason. I honest to God thought we were about to play some hide and seek, but that's not how that shit went down. So I'm a little bit bamboozled by that. What the fuck? Else? Okay. So I found the little shit. He doesn't want any pizza. And to be honest, good. Fuck it. More for me. Where's, what's in here? Okay, here's the old folks room. Or no, this is, this is the office. Is that, that's a, why did I take that? Okay. <laughs> what am I going to fucking wear that? Why did I just get, wait a minute. Why did I just get, uh, whatchamacallit? A box full of hot dog recipes. Okay, kind of a kind of a weird recipe book to have. Let me take this battery. Y'all know right now I'm basically just doing a thorough investigation of the whole map to try and figure out where all the shit's at. It looks like all the books are about hot dogs. How fucking bizarre. Okay, right. So I'm just getting the lay of the land, figuring out what items I can find, what items I can't. I was gonna say I'm hoping that doesn't blow the fuse box, and it didn't. And then I'll go downstairs and call Sex Ed book. Sexiness increased. Right! Okay, so I really do gotta mean. Go through everybody's shit game. 
But listen, that's the way it's gotta be. That's the way it's gotta be. Okay, so I got a back scratcher. Okay, good for extending one's wingspan. Okay, I guess I'm gonna need that for something at some point. Must be laundry day, the blind. Ah! Oh god! What the fuck? Okay, right. So a damn bitch ass bird flew into the shit. Don't trip none. I got a hairpin. Y'all know I got a mean lockpick game. Taking this journal. Is that gonna read it to me? Oh hell no. Oh hell no, bitch. I ain't reading that. Okay, y'all, y'all, y'all had a chance to read it. You should have done it. Gun case. Looks like we got a three-digit code. A few guns inside, but they're locked up, though. Okay, well, I have a lockpick, so that seems like a pretty easy entry. But at the moment, I don't need that. Okay, first things first. I did lock this window, right? Let me just quickly verify. I don't think I did. No, I sure didn't, bitch. Let me go ahead and lock that real quick. Now, I'm not certain if this is like a multi-night uh, multi babysitting gig or if this is just like a one-night and I'm gone kind of thing. I'm not really sure. The only reason I mention that is because if there's not more than one night, then that means I died tonight. If there is more than one night, then this might just be my training mission. I don't know which. So we're not going to test. Okay, let me close up all these windows. Lock up all this shit. Y'all know this is not a game to me. I'm not getting body slammed. Let me make sure I got everything locked up. Okay, this one's good. Someone's at the door. I don't give a fuck. But let that bitch get tossed. I ain't opening the door. I, I ain't expecting nobody. I haven't ordered pizza. Who's knocking on the shit, Wait, somebody just knocked on that window right now? Wait a minute, I, I definitely heard a knock on a window. I'm not certain which window. Oh, okay, all right. So I just blew out the fucking shit. I literally can't see where I am. Bro, the darkness on this game when the power's out is unbelievable. I, I, I can't even see it. There we go, we have power again. Okay, please let me get the light switch. Holy shit, I needed that! Okay, thank you to the gods. It's locked. It looks like there's a gas canister inside. Kind of we a weird place to put it, but I don't judge. Yeah, okay, right. So I've got the... Oh, okay, I see this is a setup, bitch. Okay, so this shit's a setup. But even when you turn the lights back on, they all don't come back on. You gotta go around and manually cut them shits on. Food bowl, it's empty. Oh my god, it's filled with trash. Okay, all right. What was that? I just heard some shit, but I don't really know what I heard, but I definitely heard some shit. Protein bar. Oh, I'm finding all kinds of shit. All right, let me close this up. Nothing in the microwave. Okay, here we go, gang. Okay, so I'm kind of going off right now, I feel like, to be honest. Let me read this note. Honey, we have to get rid of that damned cat. Not only is it killing my allergies, but I saw it eating a key. What kind of cat does that? I don't even want to think about getting that key back. Okay, so at some point or another, I'm going to have to go into the backyard. And, oh my god, this actually is full of hot dogs. What the fuck? Who refrigerates a hot dog? Weird ass bitch. Okay, right. So I'm definitely babysitting for some of the oddest some bitches decided to sit. Cat food. I can't reach it. Oh, but I can probably use the back scratcher to get that shit down. Wait a minute. Let me back scratch that. Oh god! Little fucking bitch! Okay, that fucking cat jumped right at me, bro. But I was able to get down the cat food, which I can now use to feed this chubby bitch. Wait. There we go, let me feed him, and then at some point or another, that bitch gonna take a shit and I'm gonna get paid, okay? I'm gonna get paid in, in cat droppings. Let me turn on this main light here, and it seems like, I don't know how many lights it is until it, until it trips the breaker, but uh, it's not very many. So let me just, again, make sure I keep maintaining my only turn on lights when I need them. Wait, what does it say? I don't need to look up any more numbers. Wait, so did I get the phone number for the, for the joint? Oh, okay, so Moxie is like my persuasion ability. Right, okay, okay, so Moxie, Moxie was really the only one that I didn't know about, and now I know about it. It's a stereo, runs on batteries, I don't have any reason to use this. So I do have a battery. <laughs> Let me go ahead and just put it in here. I mean, again, like, I don't need it at the moment. Oh, I do have a lighter. I didn't realize I picked up a lighter. Okay, wait a minute. Let me uh, let me start lighting candles, Bo. Because that's definitely going to be uh, a top-notch thing for me to have, right? Is is all these candles lit? Hold on. Let me, let me do this. Bazinga. Yeah, right. Okay, I'm actually just going to go around the whole fucking house lighting candles real quick. 
And then, I'm, and then I'm gonna figure out how to get in there. I don't really know if the person at the front door is still there. It seems like they just knocked and left. Which is top-notch primo. Uh, because if you don't answer the door, technically you never got ding-dong ditched. If you technically never got ding-dong ditched, then you can't technically get killed nasty. Okay, that's a, that's a critical thing to be aware of. Do I have this lighter in my hand? Oh, I do. Oh, you could just leave this permanently lit in your hand. Oh, that's actually fucking huge. So I think I've got all of the windows locked, which is good for me. Okay, means we're not going to get body slammed. And I'm assuming at some point or another, some bullshit is going to start popping off. Okay, I'm not really certain when precisely, but it's got to be coming soon. So we should be totally locked down, totally safe. Let me go ahead and call my friends real quick now. Uh, let's call the pizza guy. I want pizza for myself, though. I'm gone. Yo, fuck that little brat. I want the pizza. Yeah, this is Papa Joe's, where we make pies that blow your mind. This is Tony Pepperoni. What do you want? Where we make pipes that blow your mind? What this bitch talking about? Uh, hey, yeah, let me get a large pizza with, uh, just pepperoni. Interesting choice. You know... They say what kind of toppings you put on a pizza tells you a lot about the person. Didn't ask! You know what I'm saying? No! Anyways, we'll get this pie rolling over here. It'll be about 30 minutes, capiche? Why'd that bitch say capiche like you think you're Italian? Get the fuck on, bitch! Did you need nah, my address? Nah. You're already in our files. See you soon. Real soon. Oh, uh, 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 what?! Okay, so don't eat pepperoni. We're the fuck a moly, bro. Who's hippie G, bro? Let's call this bitch. Okay, let's. Okay, ringing. What's up? You talking to hip G, fool? Who? Who the? What's up, G? My spirits. Now that my best friend has called his top dog hip G, what you doing tonight, Matt Player? Uh, just babysitting. Gotta make that cash. That's how it is. Know this. Hip G is proud of his little homie. Am I a girl or a boy? I'm sure I don't know. I picked up a song earlier, so it's got me a little bit bamboozled. I, I'm a little bit bamboozled. Are they treating you right over there? They yeah, better they better. Be, or Hip G will be driving by windows down in a minute if you feel me. I don't feel you, bro. You got snacks? They gave you some snacks and some soda pops? No, they didn't give me fuck all, boy. I don't think. Yeah, no. It's a good family, I think. It's out off the boulevard. Off the beat? Homie, you're in that sweet steak. I'll be over in 15. What? Oh, this bitch pulling up at the joint. Okay, so I, I guess we about to be having a party in this joint. Okay, are the fuck right? Ring. Hello? Hey, Hillary, it's me. How's it going? Hey, I'm doing all right. I'm about to head out for my yoga class. Ain't it the middle of the night? What the fuck are you talking about? Betcha I could help stretch you out as well. I have a house all to myself right now. Sexiness checks You're kind of corny, you know that? Corny or horny, bitch? What's what? But yeah, we can hang out. I'll be right over. Wait, 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 Hip G's coming over. I better call Hip G back, bro. That, that bitch ain't coming over now, bro. I'm busy, bitch. Wait a minute, bro. I'm about to have a whole, I'm about to have, I'm about to have 2,000 bitches over here. Is this? Wait a minute, gang. Who's that? Hillary. So, you going to invite me in? Yeah, why are you wearing that dumbass headband, though? Yeah, of course, come on in. You got here fast. I was in the neighborhood. Oh, was that right? Doing your Pilates. Look at this motherfucker, boy, with her goddamn headband on. That shit's insane. All right, close the door, boy. All right, let's lock that ass back. Bazinga. So, this is what I missed yoga for? I told you to miss yoga. Uh, ask for sex. Want to hear a joke. Ask about her. Okay, let me ask about her first, boy. Okay, let's, 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 let's be smart about it. Moxie check fan. Bro, that's insane. What, 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 what the fuck do you mean? But what is, ha, yeah, right. So, this is what I missed yoga for? Okay, I guess, I guess I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I guess I'll go over this. Hey, you seem tense. Why don't you follow me up and I can help you relax? Sexiness check failed! You're too ugly to be talking like that. What a turn off. That's fucking I'm going to do my set. That's fucking insane. Okay, so what? So I failed the moxie check by trying to averagely compensate. My camera's being controlled. Actum, actum. Agent news as a bad evidence. Oh god, here we go. 
It seems there has been a pandemonium at the state asylum tonight. The police say that a riot broke out, and a handful of inmates, <clears throat> I mean, patients, <laughs> have escaped. Bitch! They're not 100% clear right now, but according to Sheriff officials, not every single patient has been accounted for. Who am I? Gang. You sexy beast don't need me to remind you that tonight is the 10 year anniversary of the brutal Ding Dong Ditch Vipper Murders. Okay, so here we go. So this is where the bullshit gets started! Well, your favorite Hadza DJ will remind you that the Ding Dong Ditch Vipper himself, who was a young boy at the time, who was found guilty of brutally blood five people to death over the course of a one night in a sleepy neighborhood of the boulevard is, or was, being kept at the hospital. Off the boulevard. I, can we, can we, can we already just know that this bitch is outside of my house trying to kill me, but I'm, I'm probably in the house. a heck of a story if he was actually one of the inmates who escaped on the night of his anniversary. Bo. Oh, good in him. Tis the spooky season, but I would hate to be anywhere near his old stomping grounds. I shiver in fear at the boat. DJ Hans Dankenstein, out! Is nobody wondering how the fuck the radio randomly turned on, bitch? Okay, so you know the first person getting ding-dong ditch ripped is homegirl out here doing her goddamn quad stretches in 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 the garage which by the way turns out you didn't miss yoga bitch so what are you talking about is my friend here bro my friend's not here yet okay so the ding dong ditch ripper no doubt used to live in this house that i'm in right now and he's gonna come ding dong ditch rip my bitch ass so let me go ahead and try and do as many quests as i can before i get body slammed because you know my time on this earth is now substantially limited <laughs> Okay, so it's stuck. It looks like there's something in the keyhole. All right, well, let's get that shit out of there. Let me see. Can I hairpin this shit yet? Um, I could use this to poke the key out, but there's nothing underneath that will catch it. Do I need, I see, I need something to catch it? For what? What can I pour bleach into? Or a cassette? Wait, let me listen to this cassette. Okay, okay, so let's go, let's go one thing at a time here. Let's go one thing at a time here. Let me put this cassette in. Will this work? That doesn't work. Fuck! Hey, sis. Oh, I'm listening to the answering machine. Say, what was that ointment you recommended me last week? My sphincter is scabbier than a hose knees. Bo. It's like I'm squeezing out lava over here. Call me back when you can. Oh, and tell your no good husband he'll never get that promotion unless he starts whoring himself out. <laughs> Why is this guy's name Velma like he's from Scooby Doo? What the fuck? Okay, so I got a cassette tape. Can I put this in here, bro? I, have, I haven't seen a place to use a cassette tape, I don't think. I got some bleach, I got a battery, and I got a hairpin. Okay, so let me figure out. It looks like they haven't been read at all, well, except for one. Am I real? Okay, so let me, uh, let me, uh, let me, uh, let me, uh, start figuring out where the hell I can use these items at. Hold tight, hold tight, hold tight. What was that noise? Is there someone in the house? Wait, what, 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 wait, what the fuck did I, well, yeah, there's somebody in the house. There's fucking Rex, dumbass. And there's my, uh, uh, uh my friend Rachel, whoever the hell. You see any shit? Why am I asking this kid about his hobbies? I could not care less! I like hiding in wardrobes. It's pretty clever. Not really. No one ever thinks to check in them if they're looking for you. I also uh -huh. like to make traps. Like in that one movie where the girl puts gunpowder in a light bulb and puts it in a lamp, and then when the guy turns it on, it blows up! I feel like that stuff only it works in the works. movies. works, ugly tramp. Okay, so this kid, an absolute fucking demon, okay? I think we can tell that from the beginning when he called me a bitch like four times when I first met his ass. Let me let me come down here. I, I'm assuming DJ, whoever the hell must have just got here, right? Or, may or maybe the pizza guy? Oh, it's a bush. It's a bush. It's a bush. Fucking relax. The door's still locked. And all the windows are locked. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I hey, you cool cats. Here's a ever update from your cool daddy, DJ Hans. Go! Freaks are gonna have to stay inside tonight. Seems like our Vevenerts say a storm is set to roll in soon. Should be an ugly one, they say. So don't be surprised if you experience power outages. Bo. Get those candles and flashlights ready, folks. Ooh! Button down your hatches, keep your clothes dry, and your clutches wet as we strap in for a cozy evening. 
Duschenstein. Out. Okay, I don't think his name was actually Duschenstein, but it was kind of Duschenstein. Oh, cool. I love fish. Is that a setup to pour the bleach in there, bro? I think this is a setup to pour the bleach in there. I'm not going to do that because there's no real reason for me to get the fish. But I need to figure out how to get the damn key out of this cat. Okay, this cat. Oh! What's up? The fuck was he doing in there? What the hell are you doing just walking in here? Why were you in the garage? I couldn't find the bathroom. I could... Uh, uh, how did you even get inside? The front door was open, man. Thought you'd be happy to see me. Looks like there's nothing to do around this place. I, I guess. Hey, homie, what's troubling your mind? Lay it on, Dr. Hip G. I, I, I don't know. I just have a bad feeling about tonight. My mind feels fuzzy. See, even more reason for me to stay. I'll be your mental clarity. Bet. If anyone try to mess with you tonight, I'll bust out my nine and... Oh, God, bitch! And the power's out, Bo. What? I guess I left my phone in my pants. It happens from time to time. More times than not, though. Great, you're a real well, hero. Man, I'll still be here for you. At least I can offer a good conversation. Just ask Hip G anything, and I might have something useful to say. Right, okay, so this guy is a motherfucker that I can conversate with at any time for any reason. I think I might have to kill the cat, bro. Filled to the brim with delectable delight. So they definitely told me that the cat has the key. Okay, and that he ate that shit, and the only way to get it is for that bitch to shit. Now, Hipji also said that the front door was unlocked, which is just straight up not true, okay? It literally tells me to unlock the door. So I'm a, I'm a little bit taken aback. Is she dead out here? No, she's still good. So, this is what I missed yoga for? Damn! Uh, you want to hear a joke? Okay, what is it? Oh, uh, why did the Gulver bring two pairs of pants? Um, I'm not sure. Uh, because he thought he'd miss! Just in case he got a hole in one! It's that one. That's pretty clever. You're splitting my sides. Oh. <laughs> Oh, is that right? I gained a moxie point, goddammit. So, this... Let me ask about her. Yes, bitch! I passed the moxie check this time. So, what's your story? We've known each other for a few weeks now, and I'd like to know more about you. The real you. I'm not really certain if she knows what she's doing leaning into me like that, but this game horny as hell. Can we go slow with all of this, please? Sure. There's a lot about me that you don't know, and I really just want to be sure you're going to be around. Like, long term. I know I can be a prick, but some things are just... Uh, I don't know. Cool. Number one, girl, we gotta get rid of that headband. You look like you straight out of 1982! It's hard for me to open up emotionally, I guess. Understood, understood. I'm working on it, though. All things in time, all things in time. Let's comfort. Thanks. Did that really does mean a lot. Yes, bitch! Plus on Here, the boxy point. take this. Just so you know that I'm serious and not trying to brush you off. What she done give me? This has been in my family for a while now. It's supposed to give you protection when you're at your weakest. What the heck is she talking about? Bitch gave me a pendant. What the hell? You will need it when help is needed. So, this... Uh, right. Okay, so I'll be right back. I gotta go conversate with my other friend, because it turns out... What the, what the hell am I doing? Oh my god, I'm showing off, bro. Oh, I'm, so, I'm stunting real quick. I'm stunting real quick! Wait, can you do infinite muscle movements? No, you can't. Okay, I maxed out, bro. Alright, wait, let me talk to my friend real quick. Uh, how are you? I'm doing alright. Been busy lately. I like those sunglasses. Why are you wearing them inside, you fucking prick? Nah, stop, stop. Do, doing what? Trying to get my new business. Oh, is that right? What, what business is that? I'll let you know when I know. <laughs> you could be my first customer. 50% off your first purchase. But you don't even know what you're selling. But that's after a 20% markup, unfortunately. You know how the economy is with all the recessions, processions, and concessions. I don't think you know what any of those words mean, gang. Uh, yeah, sure. Okay, so this guy's useless. Oh, what do you want to do? How about you turn some tunes on? It's quiet as a tomb in this mug. Yeah, okay, bet. I'll do that. I'll do that. Let me see anything else. You got any bullets? Yeah. Nice try, hombre. Hombre? This dumb bitch. It's hombre, motherfucker. Okay. Let me. Let me. Let me try this. 
Hey, Hip G, you're a ladies' man. Got any advice? I want to start sweeping Hillary off you her feet. You want to sweep a fine lady off her feet, huh? Correct. That's what Listen I just said. closely as I take you to class. Oh, God. <laughs> and most importantly, remember to treat the ladies with respect and dignity. Chicks love that for some reason. Gotcha. If you're beyond reproach, the bullshit can't approach, big. Uh, hey, I guess. That's what Uncle Stan says. And you ain't going to question Stan the man, are you? Mm, no, never. Thanks. Maybe I'll try that oh, with him. Oh, look at you. A certified heartthrob. There we go, bitch. Got me some sexiness points, too. On guard. Let's fucking go. All right, so let me go ahead and get the get music bumping. It's ran out of batteries. I don't have any. Okay. So can I still not? I don't have any reason to use this. <laughs> Oh, I was like, what the hell is that? Okay, so, I mean, I have a battery. But Stan, Stan wanted me to turn on the radio, but I can't even turn it on because it, it just says I don't have any reason to use it. Despite the fact that he definitely told me to use it. I might have to kill the fish, bro. I might have to kill the fish to get something out of here. I guess I'm going to do it, bro. Is this not it? Cool, I love fish. Am I not bleaching the fish? I, I feel like that's what I thought it was for. How am I supposed to get this damn key? Hold let me, wait. Look at portrait. What am I doing with that? Oh, a note. It's a note written to Pa. It reads, I hate it here. Behind these locked doors and barred windows, nor doorbells, ding or to dong. Oh, God. I'm coming home soon. I can promise you that. She's calling me every night. I can't sleep until I return. You never believed me, and I didn't expect you to know. I almost hope for your sake that you have moved on from that awful house. I've heard... I have a little brother now. I can't wait to bash his brains in. Okay, so yeah, the Ding Dong Ditch Ripper absolutely lived here. And apparently the new homeowners that moved in. Um unless that was their unless that was their other kid. Unless the Rex is actually the little bro of the Ding Dong Ditch Ripper, in which case that's actually way worse for me. I thought it was a totally different family. But now I'm starting to think it might all be the same family. And that the Ding Dong Ditch Ripper is coming to rip me up, bitch. Maybe the parents set me up too on guard. I don't know where the pizza's at, gang. Let me come over here and check in on Rex real quick. Oh, God! Oh, God! Okay, so I really was not looking in the right spot. Initially, this little bitch getting stomped, bro. That was it? Wait, that was it. He, he literally did that and that was it. That's actually fucking insane. I didn't even see this shit, bro. I literally didn't even see I, I screamed at Rex, and then I screamed at the shit that he actually set up to scare me. Filled with tissue. Bro, is there a fucking remote control? There it is, bitch. I was gonna say there- It has to be up here! Okay, I needed that. I think this is the next item I needed to, to progress in the story, so let me bring it downtown. Is it gonna show me a new story? Let's do, uh, public access. What the fuck? Bitch teaching me the Heimlich. Hopefully that's the pizza, man. I'm starved. Okay, well, with any luck, it will be. But it's probably not. I'm about to get ding-dong ditch body slammed. It is the pizza. Let's fucking go. Uh, I should probably put this on the table so Rex can help himself. I wouldn't mind a slice myself. Okay, bet. So let's bring it on in. Always remember to lock the door behind you, bud. Even though the bitch, bitch said the door was unlocked. Okay, which is bizarre because it definitely wasn't. We drop down the pizza, eat some of this shit. I got muscle points from eating pizza. Okay, well, I think that's probably fabricated. Maybe plus 25 fatso points, but that's about it. So, this is what I... Let me, let me see if I can sex her up real quick. Uh, you seem tense. Why do you follow me upstairs and I can help you with the You're ah! too ugly. That's insane, bro. Okay, so I got cooked again. I got cooked again! Even though I literally just got some, uh... Some more uh, muscle points and sexiness points. There's a flashlight? There's been a flashlight this whole time. Wait, let me save the game real quick. In case I get, like, unexpectedly cooked. Let me, uh, let me go ahead and drop a save. There's someone at the door. So it's just coming down the stairs. And the doorbell rang. Here we go, gang. Hello. Oh! My name is Dr. Pleasant. Fuck off! I'm sure you have heard about the incident at the state asylum tonight what about it i have come to warn you and the residents of this neighborhood that the individual known as the ding dong ditcher ripper 
has indeed escaped captivity and could very well be heading this way now if he isn't already here. Okay, so did you come with the police or what's your plan to protect me? Please, do not answer the door tonight, no matter what. You got lucky this time. But I should carve this bitch up, Bo. What will you do if you find him? Who is the Ding Dong Ditch Ripper? He is absolute evil. Can he be cured? No, not absolutely. Why he talk like that, Bo? Will he kill again? Absolutely. This guy seemed like the Ding Dong Ditch Ripper. I'm not gonna front. No, I mean, what's his name? Who was he before he killed and was admitted? Oh, uh, that would violate HIPAA. Well, that is one beast I do not wish to trifle with. Uh-huh. And who are you? I am Dr. Pleasant. I work at the State Asylum and was the DDDR's primary shrink. The Ding Dong Ditch Ripper's primary shrink. <gasps> and you're just going door to door randomly now instead of sending the police. I have worked on him for a decade, ever since he was admitted as a child. After a couple of years with no progress, I realized something about him. He is not human. What is he then? Evil. Absolute, pure, unfiltered, premium cut evil. <laughs> if evil was a man, it would be him. If evil was a sock, he'd be on your feet. This guy's fucking weird, bro. I'm about to carve his ass up. If evil was a piece of toilet paper, you damn sure he's been between your cheeks and smelling like stank. If evil was your father, bro, he'd be your daddy. Okay, I get it. So who am I? No, who are any of us? Okay, so that didn't help me at all. What will you do when you find him? I will prescribe him the only true cure for absolute evil. What's that? A dose of 44 caliber right between the peepers. How come? Wait, what? Wait, can I kill this guy? As you wish. Then I bid you farewell. And may the Lord watch over you this night. So one of the things you can do in this game... Oh, you can't, bro. He leaves. You can't kill him. I was going to say, I might carve this bitch up. Okay, 44 Magnum McGee. Gonna be fixing it to give that to me, bro. Uh, what I was going to say is one of the things you can do on this game to get, like, multiple endings is you can kill anyone and anything in this game uh, without any kind of issue. So, like, if I wanted to stab Hip G right now, I could do it. If I wanted to go stab Hillary right now, I could do it. And if I wanted to stab that damn cat, I could do it. And I think, honestly, you might have to. I cannot figure out how else to do anything. Right? It seems like I've done basically all of the shit that you can do. I don't really understand why feeding that cat was good for me. Okay, this this cat eating is not benefiting me in any real way. Let me, I'm going I'm to carve him up real quick, bro. I can't. Okay, so the, actually the cat is immune to my stats. Okay, that cat built out of Adam Nick. If that bitch don't give a shit. I'm clearly missing an item somewhere, bro. I'm clearly missing an item somewhere. I, I'm clicking on the newspaper. It's an older newspaper. One of the side of the editorials is about the Ding Dong Ditch Ripper. The young man whose name is being held from the public due to him being underage will be found guilty of all murders. He is to be sent to the state as insane asylum for an indefinite amount of time. However, there's an outcry for citizens of the cities. That is not enough. The Ding Dong Ditch deaths that rattled the community was thought to be the working of a large older male due to the brutal nature of the killings that left most of the victims ripped from the sternum to the groin and tortured while alive in an attic that belonged to the young man's family. These murders were from so long ago, I'm not even old enough to remember. I wonder why there is such an old newspaper laying around. I guess I can take this with me. It might be useful. Oh, you motherfucker! That's the item I needed, bro. That's literally the item I needed to get the key from the door. I just, I needed the damn newspaper the whole time. Why am I answering this, bro? It's definitely Ding Dong Dish McGee. Hello? Hello? Is anyone there? Triple Dot. <laughs> well, if you horny as hell, at least send a pick, you bitch! That's fucking insane. Okay, so I just got killed. 
by horny ass McGee, ding dong ditch, out here fucking with me. But now I can actually keep progressing in the mission. So I think for the initial <laughs> gameplay, the one that we're doing right now, well, I mean, we're gonna do them all in this episode, but like the first ending I'm gonna get, I think is gonna be the, um, the, uh, the normal ending, right? Where we don't kill anybody, we don't do anything, and then we can start to get unorthodox. Okay, let me put the newspaper underneath the door. Let me put the hairpin in the shit. Push it through. Okay, it fell on the newspaper, bet. Let me bring it back, and I got a key. To the bathroom. Oh, what? That's really fucking bizarre. Is this the bathroom? There's something stuck in the keyhole. The door is unlocked now. Oh, this is the bathroom. And there's no window in here. Wait a minute. Oh, it's shit. There's shit on the damn... Oh, okay, so this is where you use the bleach at. I'm getting jump scared here, probably. Why could I not open up the shower? That seems really bizarre. There's poop splatter all over the mirror. Looks like it's covering something, but I'm not touching it. Okay, do I have anything to clean this with? Okay, so I can't bleach the shit. Which, uh, seems like something... You oh, I'm taking a shit. Oh, I just took a shit! I thought there was poop in the toilet. Oh, I'm still shitting. I gained agility points. Okay, so my tummy must have been churning, but oh wow, I took a haymaker, but look at that some bitch. That's a big motherfucker there. Okay, so I just took a monster shit. Um, let me look down here. I got a cloth. Perfect. Okay, so let me use this to wipe this. Do I got to complete it? Okay, so I had to make a cleaning cloth. And now I can wipe up the shit. And I got a mean wipe game. 296. Let me go get the Glock, gang. And save the game. Right there. Bazinga. So now. Wait a minute. What in the hell? Did Rex do this? I mean, both somebody definitely did that. Whether or not it was Reximus Prime, bitch, I'm sure I don't know. Doesn't matter. I'm getting the Glock. Two, nine, six. Bazinga. Give me that shit. It's a gun. It's dangerous. New item found. Okay, so wait a minute. So I've got the Glock. Empty gun, but I don't have any ammo. That shit's insane in the membrane, bitch. Okay, so I definitely need to get some ammo. Rex is going to say he didn't do that. What does it say? Boy. Bitch done drew an ugly ass face on the wall. But all my friends are still alive, which is bizarre. Like, how would this guy be moving around in the house without me knowing? It makes no sense. Let me come in here and check on Rex, bro. Okay, that's almost scared the shit out of me a second time. Uh, he's not, it's not even gonna let me ask him about it, bro. It's not even gonna let me ask him about it. I just, I just gotta accept that that's something that he did. I don't really think locking the doors or not makes a difference. I'm not going to lie. I need the bullets, bro. I guess I can spare a few rounds for my little homie. Thank you, bitch. Okay, I was I was going to carve him up if he didn't give it to me. I'm not going to lie. I was going to carve him up if he, was, if he didn't give it to me. Oh! Okay, so this is a janky system. In order to shoot, you have to literally go into your inventory, click, and then you just shoot at whatever you're looking at. Same thing with the knife. Like, I click. That's how I swing. Okay, so I've got it. So now what? So now I think... Um... Oh, I got another floppy disk. Oh, they're giving me a lot of these, bro. Okay, so they're giving me a lot of these floppy disks. Which is good. Now, I could shoot the cat. But I don't really think there's a whole ton of a reason for me to do that. I gotta figure out what I need to trigger next. So I think what I want to do for, like, this first, um... For, like, the first ending we get is I'm... Is I want to try and kill the Ding Dong Ditch Rip. Okay, y'all know this shit is not a game to me. I'm trying to pop off, save Rex, kill the Ding Dong Ditch Rip. Now, whether or not I do that without getting bodied myself is up in the air. But that's what I'm going to try for. And then after that, I can get killed by the Ding Dong Ditch Ripper. Or, you know, some other miscellaneous option. And we can see what's popping with that. The power's out. Oh, shit, wait, what? It's completely smashed. I can't fix this. Wait, somebody broke it with Hillary right here? So... Bitch, are you dumb as hell? Okay, please. Okay, so I just told her to hide. And she did. <laughs> I, I, 
I don't know. He, need, he needs to ring the doorbell and ding dong ditch, bro. I got everybody hiding. I'm ready. Uh, anybody I see is liable to get shot. Oh, God. I have to find Rex and get out of here. Why? Good night. Kill this bitch. Kill this bitch. I died. They memeing, bro. That's a fucking meme, bro. Bro, how would I have died? I literally shot him like seven times. Oh god! Let's go! What's up? What's up? What's up? Ding dong ditch this cock, bitch! Ding dong ditch this cock, bitch! I fucking popped off. Okay, gang, I'm not gonna lie, that pendant? That pendant fire! That pendant fire! Alright, Rexy, let's go, bro. Where is he? Hold up. It's locked, wait. Okay, so this bitch is dead. I told Rex to hide. Wait, I don't know where Rex is at, Mo. I don't know, I told him to hide. That bitch, that, that bitch, that, that, that bitch to hide. Get out! Oh, God! I'm sorry. Oh! It's that bitch! It's the doctor! Wait. Do we win? Is everybody alive? There goes that bitch, there goes that bitch. Where's Rex, dumbass? Oh my god, that little twat lamb! He's busy. He's busy. You little shit, I popped off! I always knew he was my brother, you know. Oh, so that was, so it, so it is the real brother. Mom and dad would never say anything, but I just felt it. I knew he was coming back for me. Is that why you're such a little shit? I'm just glad you were here. You're damn right. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, so I saved little twerp. Let's 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 talk to my homeboy. I thought I thought he pulled out the John Wayne shot at the end, but I it wasn't. I can't believe we made it. You're damn You're right. You're a real hero. You know that. God hey, damn if you right. need anything, your best friend Hip G is here for you. Glad you saved little homie. I you need to call my right. mama. She'll never believe what happened. Shoo! Okay, right. Hey, that was really cool. How you had our backs back there. Give me a call after all this dies down. I have a feeling neither of us will want to be alone. Oh, is that right? And let's you talk are to the an doc. incredible individual to have survived such evil. You got that right, bitch! If you need any assistance processing what you went through tonight, please contact me. As for myself, I'm not sure how to feel now that Vic is no more. He has been my life's obsession for so long now. I didn't want to do what I had to do. But I could not allow any more innocent blood to be spilled. How the hell did he get in my house? All my doors and windows were locked! Are you ready to leave now, or would you like to talk to the others first? I'm ready to leave. I've already conversated. Another night of restless sleep. I guess I should take those pills Dr. Pleasant gave me. He said they would help. Wait, what? Bottoms up. Wait, so I'm taking some pills from the doc! All better now, right? I'm pretty sure Dr. Pleasant's a ghoul, I'm not gonna lie. Why'd I just take those? Why am I so slow? <phone rings> Bitch went ding dong, ding dong. Triple dot. Wonder who it could be. Better look out the peephole first. I'm gonna shit my pants! Peek. What am I looking at? Weird. Maybe somebody had the wrong address. What was that? Don't yell. What does it say? Answer me. Who put this there? It's a little nipple Tito. Wait a minute, it's a nipple Tito on the bottom. Uh, again? <laughs> ah! After an intense hallucination, I am admitted to the state asylum, where I will now be observed over the watchful eyes and guidance of Dr. Pleasant. You! are told your stay will only be temporary until the nightmares and hallucinations cease. Dr. Pleasant believes that you can be completely cured and can come to terms with the horrifying experience. You feel strange though, as if your icy fingers are clawing at your brains during the long nights. Something is trying to reach you. Something is wanting you. Ending three of three. To be continued! Oh my god, so Dr. Pleasant a fucking ghoul! I see. Okay, so Dr. Pleasant's a ghoul. Got it. That bitch ain't gonna get me again. So that was the 
I guess that wasn't the good ending, right? Because I, 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 I didn't live happily ever after. I wonder if it's the ending if you don't take the pills, you just go to bed. Can you even do that? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. So I'm going to boot up again. And this time, I'm not going to kill the Ding Dong Ditch Ripper. And we're going to see what happens with that. If I just, I'm assuming that's the ending if you just die, right? That's got to be the ending if you just die. Hold up. Okay, so this is where I'm at right here. Bitch, bitch, drawing on the door. Now, before I came in here, I got the gun, which I guess I can still do. Uh, but then I warned my friends, which I don't think I'm going to do this time. I'm just I'm just going to let him get tossed. I don't, I don't really know if the ending changed, to be honest. I don't really know if the ending changed based on the fact that I saved them. I mean, they were definitely there, but they didn't, like, vouch me or anything. Oh, my God. I have to find Rex and get out of here. Okay, so the Ding Dong Ditch Ripper is here. Oh, he just killed my friend. Okay, he just carved up one of them bitches. What is this? It's a note. It looks like it's from Rex. Dear dumb butt, I know he's coming for me. I locked myself away somewhere. Please don't look for me and get out of here. No one can stop him. He wants me. Don't look behind the pictures for the key. Don't look behind the pictures for the key. What pictures? What pictures? What pictures? What pictures? I mean, he called me dumb butt, bro. I'm leaving. He called me dumb butt, bro. I'm leaving. Wait, is this not an ending? Bro, I'm, I'm out. I left. I'm good. I popped off. I mean, he's right there, bro. I mean, there goes Ding Dong Ditch McGee. But, like, don't... Nothing. Oh, so I got, I'm looking for a key. Behind the pictures. Rex's hiding spot. Go get him. Oh, okay, bitch. Hey, Ding Dong Ditchy. Okay. I wish I would have lit a candle up there. I'm not going to front. Wish I would have lit a fucking candle. Look at this bitch, bro. Look at this fucking bitch, bro. Come down here with that shiesty mask on, you son of a bitch. Look at him, bro. What's he doing? I think maybe standing there is bugging him out a little bit. Oh, yeah. Look, he's trying to run at me. He's trying to run at me. That AI is crazy. That AI is insane. <laughs> Oh, that thing's a little snitch. I see. That's why it's there. Yeah, so that little bitch. Ah. Okay, ow. I'm fucking dead. Wait. Don't, bitch. Okay, he's cheeks. Wow. Let me just hug the corners. Okay, he's on me. He's on my six. Got him. No. Fuck that. Fuck that. Wait a minute. 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 Okay, so this AI is insane, bro. This AI is insane, bro. My man, I need you to get off the stairs, though, on God. Did he go back upstairs? He did. Ow! That little fucking dickhead, bro. All right, let me get twerp real quick. Come on! You gotta get out of here. Wait, we've got to get out of here. You're coming with me. Get on my back. Okay, here we go, gang. Ow! Ow! Don't chop up that little bitch on my back! But okay, we're getting carved. We escaped! Got his ass! Let's go, bitch! Sorry. Okay, so he tried to jump scare us, but we went off, so it doesn't matter. We escaped. We escaped, and I got twerp. Is this the same ending? Wait, this is the same ending that I got before when I killed that bitch. Hey, give me a call. Hey, give me a call. Wait, so I, I got the same ending. That's insane. I always knew he. Mom and Dad, I'm just glad. Thank you. Wait. I got the same ending. Only my friend died. That's that's the only difference. So those, uh, so all those. Incredible. In if you need any assistance, as for myself, I'm not sure. He's been my. Okay, so this guy, this guy's a op, bro. Uh, I'm gonna say I'm ready to leave. Okay, so I'm not gonna be taking any of his pills. I'm not taking the pills, bro. I'm not taking the doctor's pills, bro. Cause I'm I'm gonna get the exact same ending. Oh, you click on it, you have to take it. So it's it's the same thing. It's the same ending. Yeah, right, okay, so he still kills you at the end. Right, so it's the exact same ending. Yeah, right. Okay, so let me figure out how you get the other ones. Hold up. Oh, okay, so I've just done a little bit of recon a sounds, and it looks like one of the endings is you kill everybody, but then you don't kill the Ding Dong Ditch Ripper. Let me try that real quick. Hold up. Oh, okay, so my friend just gave me some bullets. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, so now we're going for the we kill everybody ending. Good night! 
Okay, so she's dead. My friend's dead. You know who gone next, bitch? Okay, that little motherfucking twerp should have called me bitch bitch like ten times, bro. That shit's insane. Okay, the power just went out. Here's Rex. Good night, my son. Bazinga. The fact that you can do that in a video game is insane. Okay, so let's bring it down. Everybody's dead, bro. Everybody's dead, bro. But I'm not going to kill the Ding Dong Ditch Ripper because it seems like everybody being dead is not the ending in and of itself. You have to do everybody's dead and uh, leave the Ding Dong Ditch uh, Ripper alive and then one dead. And there must be one where you can burn down the house. I don't really know how you get that. I wonder I wonder if you get that key um after if you kill the ding dong ditch ripper and then I'm trying I'm trying to think I don't know how you would get that key. I don't know how you would get that key. Okay, perfect. So he actually showed up. These are my victims. I won't let him reap the glory from my work. Okay, so I'm supposed to kill this bitch real quick. All right, I'm going to do the one where I kill him. Okay. Oh, bitch body my ass okay don't trip don't trip the pendant shines and disappears okay i can't die here though this is a critical part of the plan he's gonna be right here okay. bitch got his ass okay so i killed that bitch and 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 I, in this ending i've clearly gone psychotic okay i killed everybody and him and I can't let him have the glory of my killings. Okay, that, that's what I said. That's literally what I said. Who just yelled? Wait a minute. Somebody just yelled. I want to see if there's some way that I can get the the the, the key to that lock. Because I think that's an ending. I bet that's an ending. Like this. The lock case. Because you could burn down the house. Okay, so now if I've killed everybody you, and killed it. I can see it. You are even more vile than he was. How could I not see it? No. No, no, no. Not again. Oh, damn, not again. What you, what, were you aiming that at? Aim that at yourself! He shot my ass! I'm in the autopsy room. But I got a scalpel. Oh, yeah? Oh, you thought I was dead, huh, bitch? Oh, you thought I was dead, huh, bitch? Got his ass, gang. Got his ass, gang. They declared you dead. They were wrong. Dead wrong. You are not sure how you are still alive after surviving a bullet to the brain, courtesy of Dr. Pleasant, yet your eyes opened and there he was within the morgue and his back turned to you. It appears Dr. Pleasant is more vigorous than he looks. He survived your attack and called for help. It took almost 10 police officers to subdue you. You are now in the permanent inmate of the asylum. Dr. Pleasant is obsessed with you. Wait! Wait, that bitch lived? Wait, they're kidding, bro. You want to kill again. You must kill again. That's what the voice whispers in your ears every night, at least. Wait! You'll soon be out, and you'll surpass the legend of the Ding Dong Ditch Ripper. Two of three. Okay, so that was the second of the three endings. And then the other one is, I think you do everything, but then he dies. Or you kill everybody, and then he dies. Okay, so let me try that one real quick. Okay, so now I've killed everybody, but this time I'm going to escape. That's the last ending, I think. Okay, so power's out. He's here. These are my victims. I can't let him have all the credit. That's what I just said, but it don't matter because I'm leaving. Wait, you can't leave. Wait, it doesn't let you leave. So is it just you dying? Oh, so that's the ending. Okay, so I got tossed. Breaking news. This just in. It seems that there were a string of killings tonight in a quiet neighborhood off the boulevard. At least one reported dead. But our eyes and ears on the ground report that more are likely. This is just hours after it was reported that a handful of inmates at the state asylum had escaped. It is confirmed that one of the escapees was none other than Vic Matherson, more infamously known as the Ding Dong Ditcher Ripper. Don't touch that dial, as we will have more information coming in over the hour. Remember, folks, stay safe, and whatever you do, 
If your dong is ding tonight, don't you dare answer it. But this bitch can ding my dong. Come on now. Okay, wow. So that was the third ending. That was it right there, Bo. You were close to becoming yet another victim of the Ding Dong Ditch Ripper. They don't know how you managed to survive. Your broken body lays unconscious on a hospital bed, and luckily so. You have let all your friends down today. Rex, Hip G, and Hillary all were slaughtered. Wait. Okay. You are broken, both physically and mentally, and the killer is still on the loose, dinging and donging to his heart's content. You will live to see another day. Perhaps you will overcome your pathetic nature and seek revenge. Or perhaps you will stumble through life a broken vessel haunted by either the fact that you allowed your friends to be slaughtered or that the ding-dong ditch ripper got the better of you. This is the worst ending you could have achieved. You are neither a hero nor a, a villain to be uh, feared. Fuck! Okay, I cannot read, bitch. I cannot read. You're not a hero or a villain. Okay, that's what it said, bitch. I said you're not a hero or a villain. I don't know how you get that fourth ending, bro. Let me see really quick. Let me see how the fuck you get that key. Okay, gang, I just tried to do a little bit of recon a stones and cheat. I can't figure the f*** out how you get that damn key. So if y'all know down below how to get the key, let me know immediately. And maybe I'll come back and show y'all that, where we get the, the secret ending of this game. But for now, I'm gonna call it right here. I hope that y'all enjoyed this gameplay of the Ding Dong Ditch Ripper and all of the obvious endings. Okay, I, obviously we didn't get the secret ending because there are apparently four and we only got three. Even though it says three out of three, there's four. Okay, bitch, do not be bamboozled. There's four endings. I don't know how you get the last one, but we got all of the normal endings. So I hope that y'all enjoyed this gameplay. If y'all did, make sure you do that standard as YouTube shit for me. You like the video, you subscribe, and y'all let me know what else you want to see down below. Let me appreciate y'all. Bye!